I think I'm going berserk. Boom, 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 boom. I think I'm losing my mind. Boom, 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 boom. I'm getting lost in the shuffle. It happens every time. Here we are, guys, with Berserk. Not the Berserk I was just singing about. That was the old arcade game on some weird video game album I had as a child that had songs about video games. Uh, this is Berserk by Cornel Kizielovich, uh, the gentleman who made Doom RL, the gentleman who made Diablo RL. We've looked at Diablo RL. We also looked at something else of his. Diablo RL was impressive as hell for what it was, but the, the, whatever the other thing is that I can't bizarrely remember at the moment, I loved. I remember loving it. Um, I'll try and figure out what that was at, well, at my own leisure. Um, some other familiar names right here. We can see Glowy. We just saw something of Glowy's as well. This is... Let's let's examine for a fact the fact that I'm playing like new roguelikes pretty much every day. Glowy was like two, two to three days ago. We looked at whatever his roguelike was, and I liked it. Don't remember offhand what it was. There you go. Um, anyways, this was made for the October uh, minigun, or the Orange October minigun challenge of 2006. And as I said, it is not based on the Berserk arcade game, which is about robots. Here's what this one's about. The game of tactical bloodshed. The inspiration for this little piece came from the great anime and manga Berserk, which I'm not familiar with. It bases on the dark fantasy setting of humans versus demons and the concept of an, an inhumanly strong berserker warrior fighting a doomed defensive battle of survival against the overwhelming demonic forces. There's only one goal. Survive as long as possible. So we're talking about a game you cannot win. You are doomed from the start. But I guess... I don't know if there's a, I don't know if there's a score, but you're, doing, you're going to try and do your best to survive. That's why the playing field is limited only to the battleground. Running away is pointless. Also, the capabilities of the main character are based around guts from Berserk. Again, don't know who that is. Um, he just also mentions the fact that uh, it doesn't you know, go into Berserk's rich plot. It's just about slaughter, so don't worry about that if you're a fan of the uh, manga he's referring to. Um, very short in gameplay, no saving, there's no win. Just take as many of them with you as you can. Fear not, though. Your own, your, you won't sell your soul cheaply. You have an arsenal of deadly toys, though there is no inventory system at all. Only power-up-ish items to be used. Um, there you go. Um, let's give it a shot. I've, uh, I've, I've actually seen a video of this played. I haven't played it myself, but I watched a video about it, and I thought it looked like colossal fun. Uh, it, uh does it tell me the controls in the, uh, readme? Let's just check that first of all. No. We have to figure that out in-game. Let me try that as well. All right, here we go. Uh, let's press enter to begin, as instructed. Please choose a game mode. Endless is a mode where you fight waves of monster each night, gaining experience after each survived arena. Massacre is just what it says. Pure bloodshed without any distractions. I think we want endless, because at least, the, even though there's not a, a, a victory condition, there are, like, many victory conditions. Can we survive wave one? Can we survive wave two? Um, if there is no score, and I don't know if there is or not, uh, at least that'll give me something in the future to say, hey, I made it to wave three this time. You know, it gives me a measuring stick. If it's just pure uh, endless monsters then I have nothing to measure against. I need my metrics, man. Endless. What's your name? Um, Guts. Wasn't that the character's name? Guts. Choose your basic statistics. Up and down to navigate right to increase and left to lower. Unspent points may be used in the next, adv in the next advancement. Uh, one moment. <laughs> my apologies. Post-nasal drip. Okay. Uh, what are we going to do here? Why am I playing with my mouse? Let me get the fucking mouse out of here. Um, affects damage. Affects your chance to hit, your accuracy, your dodge, and your speed. Increases your hit points. Increases your energy. Increase, decreases knockback. Increases energy. Quickens pain recovery. Quickens energy recovery. Affects berserking. Um, this one costs the most. Can we make a character where we don't take dexterity at all? What will happen? Let's try it. Put two into this, two into this, two into this, and more into this. Nah, fuck that. Let's put one in there. All right. Done. Choose a skill you want to upgrade. Most skills offer some otherwise unattainable option in the game. Further levels increase that option's effectiveness. So we could take Iron Man. We only have these three to begin with. You can see these, these, these uh, alternate three at the bottom rely on you having other things. You have to have higher strength. Have to have higher st and and sweep attack level two, blah blah blah. So we can't take any of those. We can only take these. Iron Man max level is 100, requires nothing. Each level of the skill makes you tougher by giving you an additional five hit points. Meh. 
This skill greatly improves the benefits of running mode. Each successive level increases speed and reduces energy drain. Or this. This skill allows you to attack three enemies at once as long as they stand side by side and beside you. The attack is less effective than a normal one, though. Each level reduces the time needed and energy cost. I said man, but Iron Man actually sounds the best out of those. I'm going to take this. All right, here we are. Uh, Let me move the mouse completely aside because I'm going to be grabbing it left and right. You can see our health bar. You can see our energy bar. We have these um, power-up items. Let's try... Oh, H. Berserk. Press H for help. Okay. I just wanted these um, these tips over here. Fire the crossbow is F. Reload is R. Fire the cannon is C. Reload is capital R. Throw a knife is K. Throw a bomb is B. Use fairy dust, capital F. That uh, heals you all the way back to full. And yes, we have to manually choose the sweep attack. We can't just... Um, it won't just be a... Um, you know, if, if three guys are standing there, we won't just automatically hit them. One moment again. My apologies. Okay. Don't want to know any tips and tricks. We just want to die in our in our own way. Oh, we got a J jump attack is interesting, too. I think you probably have to unlock that, is my guess. Run mode would be tw- tab, but we didn't take extra running stuff. All right, fuck it. Let's, let's give it a try. It, uh, oh, my num lock's not on, I guess. Um, here we go. It um, specifically said period to wait as well. I find that very odd. I wonder why it's not... Why don't people use the 5 key? Can we use L for look? We can. Here we go. What is that? Oh, no. It's a beast. It's unhurt. I think those are the basic... The, the most basic enemies there are, are beasts. Let's get three of them together. And let's use our fucking... Oh, they didn't all come together. What was the uh, key to... Oh, fuck. I tried question mark. Uh, we want to use sweep attack. S. S to the left. You can see that use some of our energy. Um, that's like your stamina that comes back as, I think, as you rest and stuff. Um, so we missed one of them. We hit the other one. Let's just kill them manually. Fuck this. This is bump to attack them. What about firing that crossbow? Should we bother? Nah. Fuck that. We've only taken one damage so far. Yeah, five does not work. Period. Period also does not work. On the uh, Period on the keyboard works. Period on the keypad does not. Odd choice for, uh, for key. Anyone ever making a roguelike, use the 5. If, you, if you're using the numpad, use the damn 5. You're insane if you don't. Insane, I tells you. What is this guy? Oh, it's an imp. They can shoot from a distance. An imp, unhurt. I don't think we can learn anything about it. Let's try hitting enter and see if it says anything. Or R for recall. No. Alright, let's just go kill the bitch. I shouldn't use that word. Let's go kill the imp. It's a very small screen, eh? It doesn't scroll. It's literally just very small, um... Definitively what you call a bull demon. It charges. We knocked it back, it looks like, or else it's running. Um... Definitively what you call an arena... An arena roguelike. Uh, where, where the gameplay is literally, essentially, us, us fighting in an arena. I don't want to use any of my power-ups if I don't have to. We've only taken nine damage. I think we're okay for the moment. That may change, of course. I feel like we need like a fucking hard hitting heavy metal tune to back this up. This this eye has gotta go. This guy's killing us. That was a mistake. That was a tactical mistake, ignoring him. I also don't know if we get our um health back in between rounds. Can we cross water? I don't even know. Period. B. You oh fucker, that little guy's trying to get me. There he is. Or at least there's one of them. We need a hard driving song to back this up. Maybe Born to be Wild. In MIDI format. I gotta I gotta take care of those guys with the crossbow from now and I can't charge the eyes. It takes me too long to get to them. And I take too much damage. I can, I can deal with the uh, the bees. The various bees, I think. Oh, maybe not. All right, let's try a... Uh, let's try a shift... How do we, how do we show, throw a fucking bomb? We throw a bomb with a B. Little B. B. And we can target it right here. How, how big is the burst effect, do you think? If it's big enough, I'd put it right here. Let's put it here. And hit enter. No, hit B again, maybe. 
Yep. Oh my god, that was big. Big enough to hurt me. As a result of being hurt, I go berserk. When you're berserk, you, I think, do extra damage and shit. We do have our fairy dust to fall back on if we're getting too, uh, too damaged. We might have to feed the, uh, berserk meter here with, uh, kills or something, though. I don't know what, how that works. It is not, um, let's try the crossbow. There's not a detailed, um, instruction manual. S oh, C is fire a cannon. Let's try firing a cannon. Whoa! That does, that does a, a large uh, wave of uh, damage. We don't want to use that on that. Let's uh, try the crossbow. H for help. Fire crossbow, F. What is that thing? Oh, that was a B down there. I was like, what is the X? I got it. F. It's already bruised. Let's reload it. No time! Need to kill! I guess you can't uh, do shit like that. You can't reload when you're berserking. We may die on the first level here. Like I said, we have the... Uh, we will use it if we have to. We have the... Fuck. Fairy dust to fall back on momentarily. We may have to. The problem is, it will take me out of berserk mode as soon as I use it. Alright, we have to use it. Is it F, capital F? As soon as we use it, we'll come out of, uh, we'll come out of um, Berserk. But you can see it fully heals us. Alright, sweep attack. S to the south. You evade, what? Most of them, I missed most of them. I would use a fucking bomb, but Christ, they're all on top of me. Right, here, here at least I can hold some of them at bay. Are we dead? We're dead. Let's try it again. We got killed by the da. I didn't play that well. There's our. That was our test game. Let's do our our real honest to god. Now they're in trouble game. Whoops. I guess we gotta start it over. <laughs> we got two playthroughs out of this. That'll be it. I want to at least show you the second level. I know for a fact that there is a totally different map on the second level. Let's move this over here, like this. Let's move this off the damn screen so we're not annoyed by it. Uh, we want Endless. I'm not going to play Massacre. Um, let's be... I don't, I, see, I don't know the manga universe, man. I don't know that universe at all. Um, I can't think of that character's name. I don't remember. I'm going to call him Gatsu. Is that... No... Maybe I saw that earlier in the video. What the hell? What, what the hell name is that? Um, I fucking don't know. The only real hentai I've ever watched, or manga, whatever the hell he's called, the Jap Jap Japanese animation series, is um, the fuck is it called? Uh, the only one I really got into. I'm watching a bit of uh, Kuro Makuro right now. It's called Kuro. Um, but I also watched Gun you No know, Sword Art Online. That was a great show. I loved that show. Let's take two dexterity. Two of these. Two of these. No willpower. Enter. Let's try Iron Man. Our sweep attack didn't do shit for us last time. Let's get a few more health points in there. All right, little bees. Let's try and be a little bit tactical here. And I do mean a little bit. That is a scavenger. Don't know what it might have an ability. I don't know. I don't know much about it. But I do know if I can take them on one at a time, I'm going to fare better than if I take them on a multiples at once. So let's, let's make that the, the cornerstone of our um, strategy will be to take them on one at a time. Where possible. That's really the only trick we have up our sleeve. I thought there was a red T coming at me at first. So that's a bloody tree. The, you can see the, the map is uh, procedurally generated. It's different here. There's a little bridge there. I don't know if it matters. I don't know. If, I don't know if there's any penalty for crossing the water if it's purely decorative. Fuck! Here comes a fucking imp. There. You want to deal with me, imp? You come deal with me. Taking a little, a little cornerstone like this might help a little bit. Of course, I can't see what's coming at me either. 
I was passing my turn. Hoping and assuming monsters will show up. Pain, minus one. I'm not sure what that did. On the other hand, if I can deal with this guy quick. Fuck. Let's get up here where that imp can't get us. Come on, Mandragore, whatever you are. Kill that imp. Alright, I'm going to fire my crossbow at that imp. What is that? F? F. You can't fire in combat just because there's a guy next to me. F. Killed the imp. Reload. You reload the crossbow. Let's try firing into this guy. He's bruised. Hit him. I hit him three times? Is it like a triple action crossbow? I don't know. Maybe in the, in the series. That's what it is. Unless, uh... I think I fire without reloading as well. Maybe I reloaded. I can't remember. Alright, I'm going to try firing at him again. Maybe, maybe we get some of this shit back in between rounds. I don't know. If I can keep him off me. Here comes an imp. Let's get away from him. Feels like I got some of the heavies out of the way. Whoops, why did I do that? I deliberately passed my turn for some reason. When he was standing right next to me, I was just like daring him to hit me. Yeah, it feels like we got some of the big, the, like the Mandragores. I don't think there's that many of them on the level, so hopefully they're gone for the... Fuck, I can't kill that S to save my life. It, it, it looks like it took out a tree. Did the S take out a tree there? Did I see that, or did... Am I... I'll have to watch the playback later. Fucking eye. You can fire the crossbow multiple times without reloading. Officially. Seems like it's best saved for the... Uh... Maybe you can... Oh, I see. 12 and 6 reloads, maybe? Maybe it has 12 shots per thing. Maybe I've been wasting ammo by reloading too soon. Looks like it has 12 rounds. Maybe it fires 3 with every shot. Yeah, it fires three with every shot, and we can reload it six times, it's looking like. Knocked him back a bit. I don't want to reload it yet, just in case. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I've been wasting ammo by doing that. Here comes that and symbol. That was the da, right? Oh, it's not even da, it's Ian. Ian has appeared. Now kill all of them. Fuck you, Ian. I hit, I go Berserk. Alright, well, Berserk seems like a good time to take down Ian, doesn't it? The Ian dies. Weird that it was Ian until I killed it. Then it was the Ian. Here comes an H. I don't know what the H is. Phase Hound. It blinked. So they can teleport short distances, it looks like. It's dead. That must be all of them. For tonight, that is. I don't know if we're going to heal. We'll find out right now. At least we'll see the second night. I don't think we'll get to the third. Not with my playing abilities. I was better at chess rogue, for fuck's sakes. <laughs> Berserk Night 2. Do whatever you want now. But if you disturb me, I'll kill you. Guts. Which apparently only has one T. I guess I spelled it wrong. Continue or save and exit. It said it didn't have a save. But we're not going to save and exit. We're going to continue. Choose which statistics to upgrade. Up and down to navigate. Right to increase. We've only got one point. Hmm. I think strength. Yeah, it costs two for the dexterity. Choose a skill you want to upgrade. We didn't use running. Should we should we try it? Just to, we're not gonna well, we definitively are not gonna win the game. It can't be won. So do we experiment in the in the interest of fully understanding the game? That would make sense. We've seen sweep attack in action. Wasn't so impressed with the sweep attack. But um but our dexterity is higher now than it was in that first game, isn't it? I think. Maybe not. Can't remember. Um, 
course, if we go into running mode, we can charge those imps, right? Or get away from monsters if there's too many of them. Let's try running. So we got back a lot of our health, obviously not uh, all of it. And we obviously got some reloads. We have more bombs. Our, we, our cannons partially reloaded. Our, our crossbow has tons of stuff. I don't know. I, we, we didn't experiment enough to know if it... Like, if we had used all of our fairy dust, would we now be at three? I don't know. Unfortunately. I wish I did know. Um, Actually, we want to get to the third level, because I've seen... Uh... Oh, fuck. I did that wrong. One guy I've seen play this, I've seen a single video online where it was played, um, made it to a level where there was townsfolk and shit, and I'm really curious to see. I'm going to try my crossbow on him. Really curious to see how that comes into play, if you have to protect the townsfolk or what. You know, like in an XCOM mission or something. But this is looking like a similar level. I also want you to see the fact that all the levels are not the same. I mean, obviously it's procedurally generated. You can see that the trees are in different places in the... Uh, well, not even trees anymore. Now it's a kind of broken wall. But uh, there was... The river's in a different place, obviously. But uh, more to the point... Fuck, okay, I don't like the mandragores. I'm going to try and kill it from a distance if I can. I've got lots of ammo for this thing. Reload. Looks like I killed the beast beside it, too, with that. Kill the mandragore without it getting to us. Reload. Period. Kill it. Let's fire on this beast. And again. Or that wasn't a beast, I guess. It was a bull demon's paws. I'm frightened of the mandragores, man. Not knowing what they are. Their name sounds impressive. I'm also frightened of the imps, for obvious reasons. Alright, so do we reload? Let's fire on him. Looks like we're almost out of shots for the crossbow, actually. One way or the other. For better or for worse, we're almost out of shots for this thing. Phase Hound. Makes me curious about the series. Maybe I'll look it up. Looks like a fun series, based on the, if, if, if this lore is in any is in any way indicative of what this story is about. This looks fucking cool. If it's not on um, Netflix and not on Amazon Prime, though, it's unlikely I'll be able to find it. Let's try running tab mode. You see our energy went down there, but we were able to charge in there and get him pretty fast. Ooh, he knocked us back. Fuck you, face hound. Alright, we're doing okay now. We're getting the hang of this shit now. The first game was just warm up. That is the inevitable. It doesn't matter what game I play. I get a little level of uh, of arrogance going where I think I've got something mastered, and then moments later I'm dead. So that was the uh, the obvious signal to all who are watching this that I'm about to die. Fucking take some. Oh fuck, we're berserk. I don't want to waste the fairy dust when I'm berserk. Now I'm wasting it. Fuck, I'm having some trouble now. Why? Oh, it's because my pain is high. Look at that. We need to get away from this. Let's run. Because our pain is too high. If we get our pain down, I think we'll be more effective. Let's also try this. Let's try a uh, B. Um, way the fuck up here. Because it hurt us last time. Let's try it right there. I don't know if it hurt us there at that time or not. I'll try it again. There's a lot of them. Alright, our pain is back down to manageable levels. It's interesting. I didn't know what was happening there, why we were missing so consistently. It was obviously the pain. This 
an interesting mechanic. I just don't I don't know enough about it yet to uh Oh he can hit me from a distance, let's not let him do so. I got him. That must be all of them. For tonight, that is. Press enter. Okay, dudes. Berserk Knight 3. Do not pray. If you pray, your hands will close together. You will not be able to fight. we got to say it like a Japanese animation, the way it's translated. Uh, I'm not going to try it right now. You will not be able to fight! Continue. Choose. Which is I'm taking strength again, man. It seems to be doing alright for us. Let's be so strong that everyone's like, holy fuck, don't fuck with that dude. What is an impale attack? This skill makes you dash one step and attack in the given direction immediately with greater strength. It only works only if there's exactly one free space between you and the enemy. Each level decreases energy and time cost. Let's try it. That sounds fun. Uh, how do we do that, by the way? H. This is going to be one video, so we may go over the 30-minute mark. We've got about four minutes left. We may not. We'll probably be dead in a second, but... Just saying, it may it may happen. How do we do that? It may be automatic. I don't see an eye for impale or anything. Let's find out. If I w go here, now I try to go northwest. There's exactly one space between us. Let's see, let's see if it works. No. Maybe you got to do something. Run. Maybe you have to be in run mode. Sweep attack, whirlwind attack, jump attack? Maybe it's jump attack. Period. J. You don't have the jump skills, not that. I for impale. Impale, yeah, it's just not listed. Um, so I is the uh, key. I don't think you're going to waste it on be little bees. Um, let's see if our energy's coming back as well. Yeah, it's just not, oops. It's just not listed here. You missed one, sir. Or it's 79. Yes, try it. Ha! Ah, impaled you. I, east. Did it again. Period. Oh, he blinked. There we go. He's dead. Our energy's coming back slowly. We obviously can't be too liberal with the use of that, uh, that thing. You can see our crossbow's down to 24... I guess that's, we have 12 rounds in the crossbow, and we have 24 rounds total, so we don't have that many. I was thinking it was 24 reloads. Oh, it destroyed a tree again. That's kind of fascinating to me. I, east. Matagor's dead. I'm going to fire my crossbow here. And again, I want that imp out of the way. It might end up being a long video. I don't know. We'll see. It depends on how well I can fare. There's no real reason for optimism yet. <laughs> but I'm doing better than... I. We're still... I, I, I'm telling you, there are other levels. I've, I, fuck. These guys are getting too numerous all around me. Whoa. Nope, fairy, right off the bat. My pain is also too high. I gotta pay attention to that. Run. Run, you fool. Fly, you fool. Oh, you can't go to the outer edge. We're just trying to get our pain down. It'll also give me a chance to do this. B. I might have been caught in that. I'm not sure. But it looks like I killed a fuck ton. Six kills. All right, pain is getting much more manageable. The scavenger eats a corpse. Okay, they can do that. One of those are... Well, obviously they're based on this. This, uh... Series. I was going to say because of his uh, oh, magazine is empty. Reload. Fire on the imp. Fire on the mandragore. Fire on the mandragore again. Attack it manually. I. 
You're too exhausted to do that with one O and the two. Period. Attack. The face hound evades your blow. You evade. Alright, pain is back down to nothing. A pain thing is a neat, uh, a neat um, feature. Don't often see in other games. I don't fully understand it, but it's cool nonetheless. That was a terrible shot. Did you see that? My shit went flying everywhere. My crossbow is empty. Let's reload it. Let's fire on the Mandragore again, because I'm afraid of the Mandragore. One last shot on it. Oh, he can't fire, because he's on us. What happened to the scavenger? Did I kill it somehow? The Mandragore consumes the scavenger. That's interesting. I, North, killed it. My health is getting very, very low. My fear is getting very, very high. Keep an eye on that fucking health, man. If it drops at all, we gotta fairy dust it. I don't wanna waste it. I don't wanna do it until I have to. Do I have a shot left in my crossbow? I do. Let's see if we can take out this last imp. Nope. Run. I'm berserk. Fairy dust. Running low on fairy dust. My pain high? Why am I not hitting? Take off the run mode, by the way. I, north. All right. This is an interesting game. Um, I wish there was a victory condition. Even if it was like, can you survive? What the fuck is that? Even if it was like, can you survive the, uh, you know, ten knights or something? A defiler. Sir, what are you? I want to run. Southwest. Then southwest, then up, then like this. I'm going to try and get the defiler and other things in. That's going to fire the cannon. What is that? C? Fire the cannon. C. East. Boom. Hmm. Still in run mode. Let's try and... Let's take that off. Oh, I was going to try and fucking... What the hell is that now? I was going to try and charge it. A spore. Let's kill the... What are these spores? What are they? They're dying easy enough. I impale to the east. Got him. How do I reload my cannon? Shift R. Jesus Christ. Let's try C. To the west, or east, pardon me. All right, we got rid of the defiler. <sighs> Fuck. Let's run. We can only run the one step. And then we're out of, uh, out of energy. Abab has appeared. Don't know what that means. There is a slim possibility that, um... Can we, can we impale? No. That... I'm playing this seven day roguelike version and there has since been improvements. Um unless we end up in the in the town level I, I saw next. There we go, we got through that. That must be all of them for tonight, that is. Presenter. We're doing way better than I thought I could do. Berserk night four, a friend would not just follow another's dream. A friend would find A friend would not just follow another's dream. A friend would find his own reason to live. That's my anime voice. Griffith. Um, fucking strength has been serving us, man. Is there a reason to deviate from that strategy? Done. What does jump attack do? Jump two squares away using the sword as a jump pole. If there's a monster under you during the jump, he'll get impaled. That's fascinating. But I'm just going to take impale attack again, I think. Decreases energy, time, and cost. Uh, let's hit enter. 
stick with impale. Yeah, see, we're still on the uh, we're still in the same kind of town. I'm telling you, I saw this other dude playing in a. Or we're not in a town, rather. We're still in the same kind of terrain. I saw this other dude playing in a town, which means it's possible we're playing an early version of the game. I I don't know. I'll include a link to where I got it. I think it's the only version out there. Or it's possible he maybe he played the not the endless mode. He played the other mode maybe, and I didn't notice. Or it's possible that uh, maybe it's random where you end up. Maybe just be coincidentally getting the same kind of terrain every time, but it didn't have to be that way. The face hound dies. The smell of death. What does that mean? What is though? Maybe that's why. Maybe that's bringing the smell of death. A wraith. That would do it. <laughs> Let's try firing our crossbow at it. And missing. Let's move a little closer to it, because we seem to be a little more accurate when we're closer. What is a skeleton? Let's get the fuck away from these things. There's too many of them. There's too many, man. They're all around us. Impale to the west. I don't know how you technically impale a skeleton, but but I'll take it. Impale to the west. Kill, 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 kill. Doing all right now, man. Again, I'm afraid to get my hopes up. And more to the point, hopes up for what? We can't win. There was a... Run. There was a Halo game that featured. Was it? Was it the one with the recon spinoff? The one when we were the like the standard soldier, not um, not Master Chief. Where um, there was a level that was kind of a horde mode. Um, impaled to the northeast. Fuck, these guys are getting too um, annoying. All right, we got rid of them. Running automatically um, disengaged because... Fuck. Berserk. Keep an eye on the health when you're berserking, man. It can obviously be a boon to you, but it can also lead to your death if you're not being observant. Let's kill everything we can get our hands on quickly. Impale to the east. Particularly wary of the imps when I'm berserking, because you don't even notice that they're hitting you like that, you know? I think we can fire on them once. We just can't reload, right? Impale to the west. Did we kill him? Fucking kill them. Let's try to stay in this berserk mode as long as we can without unduly risking ourselves. Run mode. Unrun. Unrun! Pretty cool game, Mr. Kizielovich. As always, you have impressed me. Okay, I, I came out of Berserk. I didn't necessarily want to come out of Berserk. <laughs> I guess you can't just maintain it forever. Keep an eye on the uh, health again. I don't want to waste... Uh... Ian Ab has appeared. Let's take Fairy Dust. There you go. Is 
It sounds like when the uh, when the big bad shows up. I think you're getting near the end. I think he shows up as a like a, a final kind of boss. Let's reload. Fire. Fuck, he can hit us too. Let's get out of here. I have knives I can throw too. We haven't even done one of those. But we don't want to use it on Ian Ab, whoever that is. Because he can just blast us. Impale, southwest. I missed. Impale, southwest. Impale, southwest. I keep missing him. Maybe my dexterity is just too low to uh, to be effective here. I'm going to take Fairy Dust right now. Because he seems to do a lot of damage. I'm hitting him. Just wasn't hitting him with my impalements. Let's try again. Impale, southwest. You critically hit. Okay. I got him. Do not pray. If you pray, your hands will close together. You will not be able to fight. Got it. We're at the 41 minute mark. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I didn't anticipate it going this far. I may break this into two things. If, if I'm saying this and it's still going in like 20 minutes from now and I've broken it into two things, understand I'm saying this, well, retroactively. I may retroactively break this into two things and you'll, you'll realize thereafter. I don't know. We'll see. Let's take Impale again. I like it. All right, Impale is level three. It's the best we're going to get it. Everything is loaded up. We only have a wee bit of fairy dust. Here you go. No, it's not. It's not. It's not the fucking town level. It is different. Different color scheme. What the fuck is that blue shit? Like, what's this stuff? Ice. I wonder if it has any gameplay purpose or if it uh, or if it's purely decorative. I didn't know. Impale north. Impale north again. Die, bull demon. Impale east. I don't think we're getting through this night. I'd say the odds are very much against us. Skeleton and a wraith. Let's try a bomb. Right here. No, right here. B. I got everything except for the wraith. I think. You hear a howl. That doesn't sound good. That never sounds good. Impale west. Impale west again. We killed the wraith. And the skeleton. The fuck was howling? We're freezing. What, are, we, are we taking damage when we're in that water? That'd be interesting. Uh, I'll have to watch again in the playback to see if that happened. Impale south. What is it, a Yeti? Yeah, it is a Yeti. <laughs> I, was kind of, I was half joking. Let's try firing at it. And attacking it, and then firing at it again. I was going to impale it, but I haven't got enough uh, energy, I don't think. Attacking it. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. Fuck. Pressing all the wrong buttons. There's several yetis coming. Impale north. Those things take a beating. Let's use a bomb. Right about here. That's too far. Is it? I just don't want to get caught in the blast, that's all. Okay, get rid of all of them. Impale? I can. Okay, on 20 I can impale. Let's try it again. No, we can't, of course. Dudoy. Let's fire at it, though. Attack. Let's get rid of the little bee. So we're not taking damage from two sources. Alright, the Yeti is dead. <sighs> Fuck me. Cannon. West. Boom. Reload. Burn.
Berserk. Impale south. Don't want to waste this Berserk mode if I can avoid it. Impale east. I killed the bull demon. Is it saying freezing or anything? Yep. Is it hurting me? I don't know. I can't impale. Fuck. Impale south. I knocked it back, I think. Can't impale, so I'll just pause. Let it come to me. Okay, I got it. Oh, the Yeti consumes a beast. Yes, and I'm not hitting it. It's just dodging in that way. By attacking others. Alright, it's dead. I can't reload. I was going to reload my cannon and blast the fuck out of those guys to the east of me, but uh, I can't. The Yeti critically hits me. Time for some fairy dust with one health left, I think. That's my only fairy dust. We're done. Holy shit. Alright, let's try throwing a knife at the Yeti. Again. And again. I hear a howl. I think there's another Yeti coming. There is. The howl seems to indicate Yeti. Yeti approach. Impale southeast. Impale northeast. Fuck this action. Berserk! I have one health left, guys. And no fairy dust. It's now or never. It's basically just kill what I can. That's it. Well, we made it to, I think it's night four. This is a long episode. I apologize. We're, I'm not going to split it into two. It's 47 minutes. What are you going to do? Shit happens. Um, but that was Berserk by Cornell Kizielovich. Um, Pretty cool game. Uh, again, uh, only pure preference. I love games that have a victory condition because because you're working towards something. If, if I knew I had to survive, say, to night 10 and I only made it to night 5, I'd be like, well, it gives me incentive to come back and say, i got to try new tactics and get better. I probably will come back and play this at some point, theoretically. It, it's a fun game. But what am I working towards? I'm working towards my own death. It's demoralizing and uh, and again, no, no real metric. I don't think. Let's see if there's a high score. Maybe there, maybe there's that at least. Let's find out. Press enter. Berserk Mortem text. We got a we got a text file we can open. Learn, we learn stuff about it. Uh, this is this is what it would say. Knights survive five. Okay, monsters kill three hundred eighty. I guess there's that score. Those two scores. Interesting. I wonder what our weight does. Weight twelve. So make us crash through ice or something? I don't know. The final map. That's pretty cool. Here's the full breakdown of what we killed. That's pretty interesting. An ice devil. I don't even know what that was. It doesn't mention things like Ian Abs and stuff, so... I don't know what those were. Skills, messages. Anything else? Achievements. That's kind of fun. Uh, max kills in one turn was six. Six kills in one turn, eh? I must have been berserk, and you must be moving faster than I'm aware of when you're berserk. Longest killing sequence. Nine kills in nine turns. Cool. Survive for 1,650 turns. That's kind of neat. Died on snow. That's the level you're on. Reason of death killed by a bull demon. Let's hit enter. Cool. Oh, there is. Okay, well, there you go. A Hall of Fame. There is a high score, so that does give you something to work towards. Interesting, interesting, interesting. And that's it. Thank you for playing Berserk. This game is far from finished. There are plenty of features that might be implemented. Might is an underlined phrase in my head. With the greatest one being the campaign mode. It never happened. Um, at least as far as I know. I don't believe it ever will. Cornell began a lot of uh, roguelikes, and they're, they're all so fucking good. Like, they're all so fucking good. But he never, um, he very seldom stuck with them to, to see them through to, the, to whatever his, you know, grand vision in his head was. He made them good enough to play and enjoy, 
But in the case of Diablo RL, not even completed. Um, this appears to be a, a complete game in its own right, as is, uh, certainly as is Doom RL, certainly as is... What the fuck was it? I'm going to look right now. I got It's already a 47-minute video. I don't care. I can sit here for two hours. Let me just really quickly check this out, guys. Um, I just want to know really quickly. It'll take me two seconds. Let's look up the word rogue. Basin. There we go. Uh, hang on. Blah, blah, blah. Listen to me mumble for entertainment. Let's try looking for Cornell. Let's try searching for Cornell, first of all. Cornell Kizielovich. Let's find out what what is it going to tell me about him. Um, do what it mentions. Oh, how fucking dumb am I? Aliens RL. Aliens RL was the I think I think it was a 2006 roguelike. Or was it 2007? I think it was 2007 for the seven day roguelike challenge of 2007. And my God, did I love it! That is a that was a great game. So yeah, he's made all these freaking amazing games that just uh, most of them don't don't get polished to the level he intended. And in the case of Diablo RL, as I said, it uh, never got finished. He also is, of course. Uh, working on Jupiter Hell, which should come out this year, I believe. I'm not trying to make promises for him. I think, I think it's true, though. I think I saw him write that that he intends it to come out this year. Um, the spiritual successor to Doom RL. I believe it'll be a commercial project. Project. I don't know if we'll see it on this channel or not. Um, but there you go. Really, really well done, Cornell. I really appreciate your work. Thank you. Um, let's just go back in here and finish well, hitting enter like this. There you go. All right, guys, thanks for watching as always. Let me know if you play. Let me know if you beat my score. I will include a link to where to get it. Fun game.